Hello lovely people, welcome to the Geek Cupboard, I'm Penge, and welcome to Stacklands, which is a card-based settlement builder. So we have villagers and they go around the place and they do classic settlement buildery things, like harvest berries or mine stone, all that kind of stuff, but we do all of that by placing down cards. And as we play the game, we unlock new packs of cards to do more and more things around our settlement. And I do like the sound of that. It sounds like a very intriguing twist on the classic settlement builder genre, so I thought we should definitely take a little look. It's available right Right now on both Steam and Itch. If you're interested, then there are links in the video description below. And we were given a key by the developers, which is very, very kind. So a huge big thank you to them. But anyway, let's get on with it, shall we? Let's go and build a little settlement out of cards. Okay, so here we go, and it seems that right now all we have available to us is this kind of booster pack of cards right in the middle of the screen. So it's called A New World, and it has a lovely kind of drawing of a kind of caravan on it being pulled along by, I don't know what that is, like a donkey or something. And there's a little person just there as well, I think. So I imagine this is kind of representing our settlers and they're gonna sort of yeah, settle down in this location here. So it looks like this is our kind of, you know, basic kind of settlement starter pack, if you like. So it says up here, our quest is to open the booster pack. Okay, I think we can manage that. What does ideas do? Uh, there's a lot of question marks going on. There are many, many question marks. Ah, there you go. Zero out of 28 ideas found. That sounds about right for the geek code. Let's go back to quests. So open the booster pack. So we put the cursor over that. And then in the bottom left corner, it says a new world. Click this pack to get cards. Okay, now I'm imagining, because it says five up in the corner, that there are five cards contained within this pack. So we click that and out pops a little villager. Oh, and they look wonderful. They look all sorts of crazy with kind of crazy legs going on. Okay, that's very exciting. Uh, okay, so we click again and we get a berry bush and then we click again and we get a rock. Okay, kind of all basic things. So we've got food, we've got rocks, we've got wood and we've got a coin. Okay, so now we need to drag the villager on top of the berry bush. And there's a little thing down here, complete two more quests to unlock a new pack. Oh, that's quite exciting. Right, so drag the villager onto the berry bush and now the villager is working the berry bush. So the villager is actually grabbing some food. Now what's at the, hang on, is spacebar pause? Oh, spacebar is pause. Well done game, good job. Right, so up here, it looks like we have a food kind of total. So every month you need to food, so that little sort of icon there represents food, to feed your humans. You currently have no food, get food so you won't lose your humans. Yeah, okay, that seems fair. And then we have one coin, there it is. And what's that? Four out of 20. Card cap. Okay, right, your current maximum amount of cards is 20. You have four, does not include coins. Okay, so we've got wood, rock, berry bush, and villager, and we can only have 20 cards maximum. Yeah, okay, that seems fine. I'm very happy that space bar is paused. That's very good. Okay, so then we've got a berry. Okay, and now we need to go and punch a rock. Okay, <laughs> I think maybe we should get another berry first. Let's make sure that we have enough food. So there we go. We've acquired enough food. Right, now I'll go and do some rock punching, which is all very exciting. Hang on, clear that and clear that. Um, now we need to do one more quest and we get a new pack. What's gonna be in the new pack? Houses or whatever. Um, okay, so there you go. The Humble Beginnings pack is now available. Okie doke. So, oh, continue. Okay, do we go up and click on that or what? How do we do that? Sell a card. Okay, how do we go about doing that game? Any ideas? I think we're gonna go and punch a rock for now. Hang on, let's go and punch a rock. So we've got some stone. Ah, right. So now let's go down here to wood. So let's go and chop down some trees. Um, how exactly do we sell a card? What happens with this? I don't know how to sell a card. Do we right click? Do we drag it? Ah, hang on, hang on, hang on. There was a sell thing there, wasn't there? Okay, so how about stone? Drag one piece of stone and sell it. Okay. Right, there we go. Now we need to buy the Humble Beginnings pack because we've got, ah, no, right, I see. We've got two coins. We need three coins to buy the Humble Beginnings pack. Okay, so I think, um, ah, we've got a couple of sticks. Okay, that's very exciting. Hang on, villager, go back to the berry bush. Let's go and do some more sort of foraging for berries. Um, now, does that, well, there's a sort of thing ticking on just here. So, okay, so end of moon one, Time to eat. So feed villagers. We have one villager, they eat two food. So this should, this should be okay. So I imagine, do we just press feed villagers? Eating. Okay, ah, right, so it automatically does that. Okay, that's fine. All the humans were fed. Okay, so then a new kind of moon starts. So yeah, let's get the two food in place first. Oh no, 
The berry bush has vanished. Okay, but hang on a second. Hang on. Sell that piece of stone, please. We've now got three coins. Um, can we drag the three coins onto Humble Beginnings? Stacklands Booster Pack, Humble Beginnings. Please give us some food. Right, we've got soil. And we've got another berry bush. Right, villager, get on the berry bush. And we have a tree. Okay, right. This is very good. So now our next job is to punch a tree. Like every game of Minecraft. That's how all Minecraft games begin. Um, okay, what we'll do is we will go and grab another berry from the berry bush. I and mean, if we could get four to keep us going for a couple of days, that would be very good. Ah, this is quite handy. Okay, so you can work on that. You can grab a couple of berries to keep us going for two more moons. So that's quite helpful. I imagine that would disappear. Yeah, there we go. But that's wonderful. That's going to keep us ticking over. Right, so punch a tree. Okay, let's go and punch a tree then. So here we go. Yeah, take that tree. Okay, right, just clear those things down. Cheerio. Okay, so then what do we need to do? Grow a berry bush. How do we do that? Do we put... Ah, do we put a berry into the soil? Ah, is that what we do? Okay, look, I imagine that's going to grow a berry bush. Oh, so we can grow our own kind of food. Okay, so the next thing is grow a berry bush. And then there's a load of question marks. Okay. I mean, that's going to take quite some time to achieve. That's going to take a little while to get sorted. Um, okay, so we've got some wood and a stick. Can we combine the wood and a stick? No, we can't do anything with the wood and a stick. Okay, can the villager do anything with the wood? Um, ah, we're going to turn the wood into a stick, I imagine. I wonder if we can combine sticks to make something slightly better. Okay, let's see what we do with that. Right, so now I've got two sticks. No, it, it's just piles of sticks. Of course it is. Um, how about, how about, is that their value? A stick's worth two? Uh, okay, right, so feed the villagers. That's fine, so nom nom nom, you go and eat that food. That's very nice. Hooray, the villager is fed. Wonderful stuff. Right, so start moon three. I'm a little bit concerned at the fact that that's not going to be grown by the end of moon three. Is that going to be finished? Are we going to have our very own exciting berry bush? Or... Do we go and buy another humble beginning sort of card pack thing? I think that might be worth doing. So if we put, hang on, if we sell a stick, does that give us two coins? Right, and sell wood. Right, that gives us three coins. Then we invest that into that kind of pack again. Okay, right, I see. Oh, it's different. It's a different set of things. Um, ooh, okay. We have a stick idea type thing and some stone. Okay, we haven't got enough food, however. Right, villager. What do you do with this? What do we do with that thing? Uh, I don't know. What do, what do we do with the idea of a stick? I don't know what we do with that. Do we put a berry on a stick? Or a stone on a stick? Or a stick on a stick? I don't know. What if we do the stone and nothing happens with that? Okay, right. We desperately need this berry bush to finish growing. Can you just hurry up, please? Go and give it some water or something. Go and talk to it. That's good for plants. Okay, so let's see. If this finishes, we then need to grab the food off it very, very quickly indeed. So that should finish growing. Hooray! Right, we've gone back to soil. Okay, so you go and forage that thing. Put that berry back onto that soil so that can grow another berry bush. Okay, so currently, yeah, we've not got enough food at all. But this is good. We're going to get just about enough food, I think. Oh, yeah, what do we do with this idea? What do we do with that? Now it says build a house. Hang on a minute. <laughs> I'm not quite to the point of building a house. I'm just working out what sticks and stones are. I don't really know what to do with them, apart from to break your bones. But okay, fine. We'll get another berry out of this. Right, so we've got three berries. So we can at least give people some food. But I don't know how to build a house. How exactly does one build a house? Do we build it out of lots of stone and a stick? And do we then... Okay, right, feed villagers. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. So we've eaten... And we do have a couple of bits left. Right, okay, so start a new moon. That's growing a new berry bush. So that should be fine. So we can come back to that. Um, right. I don't know how to build a house. <laughs> how do we build a house game? Uh, do you know what we might have to do? Let's sell the sticks. Let's go back that way a bit. Uh, and sell one stone. And then put those coins onto humble beginnings. What else are we going to get out of this? So a tree. Okay, that's good. Oh, crikey, that's flown down there. Another rock. And some more wood. Okay, so if we go and do that to a rock, what do we get out of the rock? We get stone out of rock, of course we do. Maybe we need a certain amount of things to build a house? I don't know. 
Maybe we need a certain amount of sort of stone or whatever. We could do with the berry bush growing very quickly. And yeah, the tree is just going to give us some wood, isn't it? I wonder if we build the house out of wood. I don't know. Ooh, flint. Okay, hang on, hang on. Could we combine flint with a stick to make an axe? Okay, hang on. Can the villager go over here and start chop, chop, chopping this wood up a little bit? Because yeah, surely... If we combine flint with a stick, that's going to make some sort of useful weapony type thing. Okay, so a stick with flint. Yes. Okay, right. We're on a voyage of discovery here. This is very exciting. Right. Um, I think... Ah, right. Here we go. So that's now going to produce, hopefully, another berry bush. You go and work on that, please. Put that berry onto there to grow another berry bush. Because that's, that's our only source of food right now. Hopefully... We can get some berries out of this nice and quick before moon four ends. Come on, come on, come on. We've got, what, four seconds left. That should be fine. Right, what does the flint and stick make? Okay, that's not what I was expecting, but it's okay. It makes a campfire. Okay, I thought maybe some sort of weapon might be more useful, but okay, no, right, that's fine. And we've got enough food to keep us going. Okay, right, that's very good. So can we put you at the campfire? No. Can we put the stick at the campfire? Okay, hang on. Feed the villagers. Okay, nom nom nom. You eat the berries. That's very nice. Soon we can get you a different diet. Imagine that. Um, stick on a campfire. Stick on a tree. Stick on a stone. Stick on a berry. Okay. Don't quite know what to do with that just yet. Okay, never mind. Um, how about then? So, villager, go and chop down that tree. That might give us some resources. Uh, hang on. Quest completed. Start a campfire. Ooh. Hang on, there's all sorts of other bits down here. Train militia, start a campfire, cook some meat, explore a forest, have five ideas, have ten wood, have ten stone, have five food. Oh, have five food. That's certainly something we could try our best to do. Have ten coins, have three houses. <laughs> How do I get one house? Ah, however, if we complete this moon, we'll get to moon six, which will complete a quest, which means we do get a new pack. Maybe that will help out quite a bit. Maybe a new pack might be like the how to build a house pack or something. I don't know. Um, okay, right. So we've still got our thing growing. Although we could do with that growing a little bit quicker, please. Yeah, I don't know what to do with the rest of these things. These things don't seem to really interact. What if it would with stone? Yeah, I thought maybe that might make something. Mix wood with stone. I thought it was going to make something nice, but clearly it does not. Um, yeah, we need that plant to grow. We need that to grow really, really quickly. Can we please have a berry bush? Because that's going to be super handy if we could get that done. Um, here we go. So that should finish. And then immediately we go to the berry bush and we start doing that. Do we put stick with soil? No. Okay. <laughs> this stick thing here is a complete mystery. I don't know what to do with it. It's like an idea by the look of it. Right. We have two berries which is very, very good. And we still have one more berry on the way, so we can get the berry bush growing again next time, which is nice. In fact, you know what? Let's get that going right now, because we still have two berries left to eat. Okay, so hopefully, when we complete this moon, we should then get a new pack available to us. Okay, so let's see what this brings. So yeah, feed the villagers. There you go, villager. You eat some more berries. Apologies for your terrible diet. Okay, so start a new moon, seeking wisdom. Okay, so that requires four coins. Okay, so I think what we do is we sell a stone, we sell a stone, we sell a wood, and we sell a wood. Four coins go to seeking wisdom. Okay, what do we get from this then? A campfire. Okay, <laughs> we've already got a campfire game. What do we do with these cards? Um, wood. We got a garden. Ooh, and we've got another berry bush. Ah, okay, that's very good. I oh, know. Hang on. No, villager, go onto the berry bush. This might allow us to stock up on food for a while. However, what we do with these, I'm not entirely sure. Because we've got the idea of a stick. Um, oh, hang on. No, it says in the corner there. It says right in the corner. It tells us a rabbit has just appeared. Okay, hang on a minute. Is that rabbit? The rabbit's hopping around. <laughs> the rabbit's hopping around the place. Okay, hang on a second. Hang on. Villager, go and deal with that rabbit. Oh, oh, hang on. Oh, there's a, there's a fight going on. <laughs> right. So we killed the rabbit and it turned into some carrots. Okay. Right. I'm not sure how that's, yeah, how that's how hunting works, but okay. Look. Right. So now I've got carrots. Uh, so can we put, hang on. So garden. I see the idea things tell us in the corner. So yeah, stack one wood and one villager. 
to create a stick. Okay, we know that already, so we can sell that on. Campfire is stick and flint. Okay, we can sell that. That's a lot of coins. Um, garden. Okay, so what can we do with the garden? One soil, two stone, two wood, and one villager. Okay, that's, that's okay. Oh, look at that. You can eat the carrot. You can have a different food, villager. Oh, it's going to be very exciting. Um, yeah, okay, so how about we try and work toward that? So how about we get humble beginnings. Okay, so we have some more cards. So a piece of wood, a tree, and growth. Okay, one berry and one soil to grow a berry bush. Okay, we worked that out for ourselves, thank you. But okay, we've, we've got that. We've got that sorted. Um, so yeah, can we pick up... Oh, hang on, we have to feed the villagers. Sorry, I didn't see that. I was trying to move cards around. Are you at the berries? You could have had a carrot. <laughs> you could have snacked on a delicious carrot. Okay, right, so pile the coins up. Um, so yes, the garden is one soil, and then what is it? Two stone. Okay, we don't have two stone, which is all a bit unfortunate. Um, how about then, uh, if we get the villager to work the berry bush, um, can we sell some of this stuff? Could we get rid of this? Yeah, we need two stone and two wood. We can get another wood. Oh no, we've got the two wood. Okay, that's fine. So put the garden uh, like that, put the soil with that. So now we just need two stone. Okay, so we have one berry. So I think what we do is we've got the carrot. So let's right, let's go over to the tree. Let's start chopping the tree down. That's going to be handy. We will sell the berry. So now I've got oh, we didn't sell the berry probably, but that's fine. We've got a carrot. Um, let's go back to humble beginnings. So we'll take a big pile of humble beginnings things. Right, so stone and a rat. Oh, okay. I suspect we might want to go and fight the rat because oh yeah, it's a, oh I think the rat is attacking us. We've missed it. It's hit us. Oh, we've got health in the corner. We've got a little sort of health thing. Is it trying to attack our tree? Leave us alone, rat face. And the rat has left behind some poop. Okay. <laughs> How lovely. Right, okay. So pile that together with that. Um, so we've got two wood, one soil, and one stone. Right, you go and work the berry bush because we need to get some more stuff. Um, right, hang on. And we have a final card, a piece of stone. Okay. So then... If we work that with the villager, that will turn into a garden, which is all very exciting. And I wonder if we can use the poop as fertilizer for the garden. So one soil, two stone, two wood. Okay, that's fine. So what we'll do is I think we'll get to the end of this moon. We'll sort this out. I mean, is there a speed? Oh, yeah, there is. Oh, okay, splendid. Right, so we'll speed time on. Get to the end of this moon. Right, feed the villagers. You can eat oh, some more berries. Okay, fine. Snack on the berries. All the humans were fed. A traveling cart appeared. Okay. Um, okay, start the new moon. What do we do with the traveling cart? Give me five coins and I'll give you an item, says the traveling cart. Okay, right, hang on a second. We've got a very important job to do. We're going to go down here and we're going to make ourselves a garden. Okay, so we can sell that kind of idea thing now for another coin. Now, what do we do with this? I think... We'll keep the berry and we'll keep the carrot. We'll keep our little sort of food reserves over there. I think, do we sell? Uh, yeah, okay, right. The villager needs to go and chop down the tree to turn it into wood. And then we could sell that piece of wood. So get rid of that. That's four coins. So then if we sell another piece of wood, that's got to be a good thing. Right, a garden. A simple building for growing food. Okay, so now do we put a carrot into there? Aha ha Right, so now we have a garden that can grow other stuff. Right, that's really, really helpful. Okay, right, so if we now go and chop down this tree, so go and punch a tree for a few seconds. There we go. Punchy punch. Right, so get that sorted. That becomes a piece of wood. Nope, that's not there. Sell the piece of wood. Five coins. Okay, yeah, let's gamble. Let's give the travelling cart five coins. And it's given us some soil. Ah, okay. And that completes another quest. But that's quite good. That soil is quite useful. Um, we can put the soil with the campfire, can we? Okay. But yeah, the soil could be combined with more stuff to then make another garden. So we can be really, really good with food. Okay, we still are struggling on how to build a house. Not quite sure how to get a house sorted just yet. I'm sure we'll muddle through at some point. Um, my concern right now, actually, looking at it, is do we have enough food? I don't think we have enough food. Can we put the berry on the poop? Is that going to grow? Oh, no. We might not have enough food, possibly. Um, we might eat the carrot. Okay, feed the villagers. Travelling cart disappears. We eat a berry. Oh, we ate the... Oh, hang on. All the humans were fed. Really? 
Oh, the carrot's got a number of uses. The carrot's got a number of uses to, oh, phew. Okay, right, that's very, very fortunate. So now we just need that to kind of keep doing its thing. I think we're a bit stuck. I think we're a little bit stuck. So the carrot, yeah, I didn't see that. The carrot's worth two money, but it's got two food to it as well. Okay, that's very handy. So we didn't starve. Um, yeah, I think maybe, I mean, yeah, that can be used to cook food. Should we have started putting food onto the campfire possibly? I mean, maybe we get rid of that soil, which means that we wasted some coins on that traveling merchant thing. But if we do that, and then we use that to go back to humble beginnings because we're very much lacking with anything. So a stone, a tree, and another villager. Okay, that's not what we wanted at all. Can we sell the other villager? No. <laughs> oh no, this is terrible. Now we've got two people to feed. Yeah, that's not helpful. That's not helpful at all. Our garden is going to be struggling with all that kind of stuff. Um, right, okay, we need to do some stuff really quickly. Uh, okay, we got a piece of wood out of the tree. Sell the piece of wood. Sell the stone. We're going to starve. This is bad. Uh, right, okay. So the tree. And there we go. A stick. Okay, we've got a stick. It's worth two. Oh, there's a couple of coins there. There's a couple of coins. Um, okay, so how about we sell the stick. That's four coins. Pile the coins up. Get Seeking Wisdom. This might have something really handy in it. Offspring. One house and two villagers to create a baby. Okay, stork letter writing is underway. Uh, flint and lumber camp. Okay, we'll keep that. And another tree. This is not going to produce enough food for us at all. I suspect one of our villagers might possibly take some starvation damage or whatever. Um, yeah, what does a lumber camp do then? Three wood, one stone and one villager to build a lumber camp. Okay, we might be able to give that a go if we can acquire such resources. Oh no, right. Feed villagers. I think our carrot's going to go, isn't it? They're going to eat our carrot. Okay, the garden grows incredibly slowly. Two humans will starve of hunger. Okay, you've died. And you've died. Okay. <laughs> and so ends the tale of our village. All the humans starve to death. Yeah, the extra person didn't really help very much. Okay, right. So we reached moon 10. 15 quests completed. 25 new cards found. Right. Okay, back we go. Let's try again. Now we sort of know a bit more about what we're doing. Let's have a look. So, villager, berry bush, rock, wood, coin. Okay, berry bush. Go and sort this out immediately. Let's get some food, please. We'll put the coin over in that direction. I do like how this could, in theory, be a sort of, you know, it could be a board game. It could be a tabletop game if you wanted it to be. Um, you have to have a timer with it, but it would kind of work quite nicely. I quite like the idea of that. Um, okay, so yeah, now we still do have access to those card packs now. We've got access to the sort of card packs that we unlocked. We still have the coins for them, but we could just go straight for Seeking Wisdom if we wanted to. Okay, so now we've got three berries. So I think what we have to do is sell that wood, sell that rock, come down here, go up to, hang on, grab that humble beginnings. Let's get some more stuff. So soil, there we go, berry bush and a tree. You go and punch a tree and let's combine the berry bush with the, oh no, hang on, a berry with the soil. Of course, that's what we want to do. Okay, so you go and punch a tree. Splendid, right, how ah, we get a stick. Okay, very handy stuff indeed. Worth two coins. That's very good. We're making some more, ah, we're growing another thing over there. We're only about halfway through the day, which is pretty good. So if we combine, hang on, hang on. Can we see the ideas? Ah, so the ideas remain. Ah. Oh, I like that. So the more you play, the more knowledge you gain about how to build your settlement. Okay, that's very exciting. I like that. Um, I think what we have to do is, I think we have to sell that stack of things and go back to humble beginnings again and just hope that we get better stuff. Um, it's another tree. You can go and cut that down. So yeah, what was the um, what was the lumber camp thing? I mean, the garden's brilliant. The garden is brilliant because that's soil, stone and wood, but it was very slow. It was really slow to grow anything at all. So possibly we might want to sort of get one of those in maybe later and just rely on berries for a long time. I mean, yeah, one soil, two stone and two wood. So we could reserve... Oh, hang on a minute. Feed the villagers. There you go. Eat your berries. <laughs> Delicious stuff. Right, so you've eaten some berries. Very nice. Nom, nom, nom. Right, new moon. Go grab berries from there. And if we set aside two wood and one stone, that should be okay for the garden. So yeah, we've got two stone, two wood, one soil. We do have a soil just there. Let's get the berries ready so we can survive till next time. 
so we're not going to go hungry on moon two. We're going to do better than moon ten this time. So let's see what we can do. So there you go, a couple of berries, very nice. Now do we combine that with that and possibly sell those two because another berry is coming in. Um, yes, possibly we do do that. I'd like to grow the other berry bush. I kind of want to grow the other berry bush. But okay, we'll sell those two things. We now need just one more coin. So if we could, do you know what? Let's sell that berry. Three coins. Very nice indeed. Humble beginnings. Let's see what we can get. So wood, another berry bush and another tree. Okay, right. So chop the tree down. We'll sell the wood and then the soil. Oh, we haven't got enough berries. Hang on a minute. We're chopping a tree down. Here we go. Choppity chop and splendid. Right. Okay, some more wood. We don't want... Oh, no, that's from a tree. We do want wood. That comes from a tree. That's how trees work. Uh, no, that's fine. So we've got two berry bushes now which is very good. So that will keep us going for food for quite some time. And then we could put that berry into the soil to grow a third. Okay, right, that's working out quite nicely indeed. Also, we do have quite the pile of wood over here. So how about we sell that and put that back into humble beginnings? Can you please give us some stone? Thank you so much, that is splendid. And then we've got some more stone and a rock plus a big pile of berries. Okay, so the garden, yeah, requires another piece of soil. Okay, we're just gonna have to wait, I think. We're gonna have to wait for that soil to be sort of, you know, to grow its berry bush, and then we can take that soil and put it down here. Okay, or do we go for a lumber camp? What else could we do? Could we build a lumber camp? We need to get, oh, hang on, villager food time. There you go, it's berries again for dinner, sorry. So if we do that, there you go, all humans were fed, very good. Um, what's our other quests? So yeah, build a house, still not got there. Create an offspring, you need a house. Um, what else can we do? Kill a, oh, kill a skeleton? Ooh, scary stuff. Cook some meat. Yeah, you have not seen that yet. Explore a forest, not quite got to that point. Have five ideas, have ten ideas. Have ten wood, ten stone. Have five food, have ten food, have ten coins. Have three houses, reach moon twelve. Sell a card at a market. Okay, we need one more quest to unlock a new pack. I mean, that'd be really good. Oh, I should probably do something over here, shouldn't I? Let's go and do some berry bush sort of harvesting. That'll do. Um, yeah, I'm not quite sure where we go next. Do we go for the garden? But that was really slow. Um, or do we go for the lumber camp? But, I mean, the garden's more important. We need the food or else we're just going to die. So that's going to be bad. So, okay, we need this thing to hurry up. So if we just go like that, speed time on nice and quick. The berry bush is done. We've got a big pile of food. So that'll keep us going for a while. And there we go. Put the soil down here. Put the villager into there. That should then make us a garden. So speed time on to get the garden done. Will it be done before the end of the year, day, whatever it is? No, I don't think so. But you've got plenty of berries. So there you go. You eat those. Very nice. All the humans were fed. Start the new thing. Right, so now we have a garden. Can we put a berry in the garden? Yes, we can. And is that going slowly? I don't know. Right, so you go and work on that bush so you get some more food out of this just to make sure that we are okay. Okay, oh, look at that. We've got four berries in reserve and we're growing another kind of berry bush thing in our garden. Okay, that's really good. That's very good. So I think maybe let's take two berries. Let's pile all those things together. We can't pile. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. You go and hit that rock. Go and hit the rock. And how are we doing over here? We've made ourselves another berry bush. That's very good stuff. Okay, I've got some flint and some stone. Okay, so in the garden, uh, let's put back... Oh yeah, you can go work on the berry bush. You lot can go into there, along with that. That gives us four coins. Seeking... Oh, hang on. Feeding villagers first. Hang on. Eat the berries <laughs> again. Yum, yum, yum. Delicious berries. Right, there you go. Start a new moon. Right, seeking wisdom. Let's have a look here. A shed. Ooh, okay. A shed, a coin, a quarry, and another tree. Okay, that's fine. So we'll put the garden over, kind of over there. Right, berries are good. Let's put the berry into the garden to grow another berry bush, because we might as well use our garden. Okay, now what do we do with this then? So the shed is... What is the shed again? So it's one wood, one stone, one stick. But why do we want to shed? <laughs> what are we going to do with this shed? Or a quarry is three stone, one wood, and one villager. Okay, I mean, we've not got anywhere near any of that kind of stuff quite yet. So we won't be doing that anytime soon. We have got another piece of wood from a tree. And we have a piece of flint. 
Okay, what was the flint again? The flint was... Oh, yeah, the campfire. There surely must be better uses for flint. Um, okay, so we've got one coin. I think we combine the wood uh, with the coin. Sell all that. Oh, hang on. We just need to sell them, don't we? Three coins. Humble beginnings. Get a new booster pack. We've got wood. Another berry bush. Okay, go and work on it. Go and work on the berry bush. Absolutely. Food is important. Um, so, yeah, we've only got two wood. We've got two wood now, and we haven't got a stick. Okay. It'd be quite nice if we could have a stick. Did we unlock the idea of a stick? Uh, one wood and one villager. Yeah, okay, so we could make a stick. That'll be wildly exciting. Let's, um, when you're finished in that, can you make a stick, please? That'll be quite useful. Um, yeah, there we go. Hooray, you've made a stick. And now we've got two berry bushes. Oh, oh, okay. I was going to say, let's not go, not, not speed time on quite so quick, but never mind. Right, so back we go. All humans were fed. Moon six, two berry bushes. Hang on, stack them up. Villager work on that. Okay, so that seems to be ticking up very nicely. Garden grow another berry bush. So that's what we need to keep doing with the garden. Just keep churning out berry bushes. Uh, and that's generating more berries for us. That's very nice. Okay, so how do we do any of this kind of stuff? What else do we want to do? What else do we want to make? I mean, is it going to be handy to have a lumber camp? Is that going to be useful? So we've got one bit of wood and that's it. Or a quarry is three stone. Yes, we are going to need to... I mean, we have got those kind of revealed to us now. The shed and the quarry are in our ideas thing. So we could just sell that and sell that. That's some coins. That's quite nice. Uh, a great big pile of berries as well. So we have got quite the pile of resources down there. Okay, so let's sell the flint. That gives us four coins. Put that into Seeking Wisdom. Let's get some wisdom. It's another pesky villager. Okay, we might be okay for a while. Right, two villagers work on the rocks. There we go. Wonderful. So we can get some stone out of that. So maybe, maybe we could build ourselves a quarry. That might be something that could be useful. So we have two stone. Okay, so hang on. A quarry is two stone, one wood, and one villager. Okay, we can make a quarry. And then we can start making stone, I imagine. Right. Hang on. What was it? A quarry. Three stone. Okay, hang on. I'm on it. There we go. So that villager can now make a quarry. Then we've got some coins over there. Hopefully... We can get ourselves another berry bush. And that villager can go working on that. So there we go. You go working on that. Take one berry. Put it over there. Right. Okay. So it's all about sort of production lines and such like. <gasps> We've got the reap and sow pack. That's got to be farming. That's got to be farming. Must be. Right. Feed the villagers. Maybe very soon, villagers. You will not have to have to eat berries all the time. Right. All the humans were fed. Right, hang on. So pause time for a second. What does the quarry do? An unlimited resource of stone. Okay, that's really helpful. Okay, we'll put that over there. You can go and work on some stone, please. Um, so now I think, uh, I mean, yeah, a shed. What do we do with the shed? I don't know. Uh, we've got a couple of coins. What if we can buy, well, if we sell the stick and then we've got some coins, go to humble beginnings uh, oh, got a spare coin. Thank you. Right, a bear, another berry bush. Okay, and a rat. Okay, go and fight the rat because the rat might drop some resources possibly. Uh, right, so okay, we're getting some stone. We're still fighting a rat. Come on, come on, villager. It's a rat. Just, just squish it. Boop it on the nose. There we go. Right, a coin came out of the rat. It's a very profitable rat. Right, you go and work on that berry bush because food is still important. This villager here is just about to work on the quarry. Okay, so we do have an unlimited supply of stone now, which is quite handy. Okay, so we're now just gathering berries. So that might help us, in the long run, acquire a lot of coins to then go to the reap and sow thing over here. But we are acquiring lots of food as well, which is very, very handy stuff. Um, okay, yeah, go and get some more stone, please. I'm aware that we can't have too many more cards. Another berry bush has popped out. That's wonderful. Garden, grow another berry bush. You get some berries out of that. Yeah, it is like a sort of production line type thing. Um, so yeah, shall we make a shed? Shall we make a shed? We need a piece of wood and a stick, which we just sold, but never mind. Um, so all we need is a tree, really. If we could get a tree out of humble beginnings, that would be quite good. If we sell that, bring that down to there. Humble beginnings. Here we go. A key. Oh, Oh, that's exciting. We have a key. I don't know what to make of the key. Um, the shed, however, is one wood, one stone. 
Um, and a stick, which could come from this. Okay, I mean, if we put the villager with the key, don't know. Uh, you villagers, stop doing stuff like that. Right, feed the villagers. They should be absolutely fine. So nom nom nom. You eat two. There we go. And we've got four berries left. So we're okay for the next day as well. So that's wonderful. Um, right. So we've got a key. What exactly do we do with that then? And what do we do with the shed? So we need one stick. So, okay. So you've got the wood. Yeah, so you're taking that apart. That's fine. So you're dismantling the tree. So now... Oh, there you go. Right, so hang on. Move that wood out of the way. Put a stick in there and a villager. So now you're going to go forth and build us... Yeah, you're going to build us a shed. I don't quite know what the shed is supposed to do, but okay. Um, and then, yeah, a key. What do we do with the key? I mean, is there something around that we're supposed to unlock? Is it like a secret treasure chest somewhere off on the map that we've not seen? I don't really know. I'm just thinking that there must be some sort of cunning thing that we're supposed to do with it. Right, berry bush. Let's get some more food out of this. And we've made a shed. Increases your card cap by four. Ah, okay, right. So that doesn't actively do anything, but we can now have a few more cards. Okay, right. Villager, go back into the quarry then. And garden, take a berry, grow another berry bush, please. That's going to be really handy. Um, I mean, yeah, I think... We need to save up enough cards for reap and sow, don't we? That's what we need to do. We need to save a big pile of money to get that kind of card pack unlocked. Um, okay, that might just mean we just spend a lot of time in the quarry and in the garden. Uh, we've got a bit of stone, bit of wood. I mean, what does the lumber camp do? Three wood, one stone and one villager. So we've got one stone, but we need two more wood. Okay, could we? Could we do some strategic selling of this? stuff? So sell that. That's one coin. Um, and then sell that and sell that. So sell those things. We're going we're gonna to sort of sell in order to try and accumulate here. Because we might get a tree. Stone, tree, and rock. Okay, that's perfect. So go to the tree. The stone is neither here nor there. Feed the villagers. They've got enough food. So here you go. Have some more berries. <laughs> oh dear, your diets. Um, yep, yeah, all the people have been fed. Now, the only problem is... Now we don't have enough food for two people. We've got enough food for one, but that garden needs to grow the thing very quickly. Okay, we've got a stick, which is not what we wanted. We wanted wood out of the tree game. <laughs> Why have you given us a stick? Okay, right. So now I think we sell a piece of stone. Hang on, you go and work on that rock. Sell a piece of stone and a stick. Coin into humble beginnings. Another berry bush. Aha, two berry bushes. Oh, it is wonderful. Right, get us some food. Get us some food, please. We're going to have three in a second. Okay, that's very good. Let's try and organise things. Right, so food area over here. Berry bushes being worked by that villager. Food can go in a big pile down here. Okay, that's working very nicely indeed. Uh, I still don't know what the key does. What does the key do? Any ideas? Any ideas? Does it unlock the garden? Does it unlock stone? Does it unlock the shed? Does it unlock a berry? Does it unlock a villager? Does it unlock stone? I don't know. I don't know what the key does. I'm not entirely sure. It does something very important, I'm sure. I just don't know what that important thing is. Right, you keep on growing another thing. I mean, yeah, I think a lumber camp's got to be where we go. It's just we're going to struggle to get the wood. We're going to have to keep selling. We have got a stack of stone there. So sell that. Put that into humble beginnings. Please give us. Please give us some wood. Okay, two bits of wood. We need three bits of wood. Well, of course we do. Hang on a minute. We can sell that for some coins. Put that into our beginnings. Okay, right. We've got three bits of wood. A house. <gasps> We've got a house. Two wood, one stone, and a villager. Okay, I think that's probably more important. So yeah, we've got plenty of food. So how about now, when this berry bush is done? Because that can't take too long, can it? Uh, yep, hang on. That's fine. Take you out of there. Okay, let's build a house. And then, yeah, so the day's going to end. There we go. Loads of food. Absolutely loads of food for you to eat. So you snack on all those things, which is very nice. Yep, they're all fed. Okay, now you can build a house. And I think you can go and work on the berry bushes for now. That's absolutely fine. Yes, we're kind of back to square one with a lumber camp. But we are at least going to have a house, which is very good indeed. We've got one wood. So we need two more wood. 
and a piece of stone, but okay. But food is looking good. Berries are just popping out all over the place, which is marvellous. So, um, yeah, okay, we've got the idea of a house, so we shall sell that for a coin, which is very good. Uh, yeah, okay, we've got a house. A nice place to live. Okay, that is very good. I'm a little bit concerned about putting both of our villagers in the house because then they're going to produce a child and we have to feed that as well. And I don't think we're quite in a position to feed children just yet. Um, okay, take a berry, put it in the garden. Uh, you can work on the berry bush, actually. Let's get a big pile of food, I think. That's going to be more important right now. So the house can go over there with the shed in the corner and the quarry can sort of go over here in a sort of working area. Uh, berries are just popping out all over the place. This is brilliant stuff. Um, I mean, yeah, do we just sell... Oh, no, hang on, hang on. We can go to that rock when whoever finishes their bush sort of thing first. There we go. Right, so put that down into there. Are oh, we completing all sorts of quests? Complete three more. So we've got a quarry, a shed, a house. We've got ten food. Yep, this is all good. Okay, so you go to the quarry and we're going to have a big pile of stone. So hang on, go back to ideas. So three wood, one stone. Okay, so now we just need two wood from there. Okay, that's fine. So if we sell those... That's three coins. Over to Humble Beginnings. Please give us a tree. That'd be amazing. No, it's it's more berries. <laughs> okay, fine. We'll have some more berries. That seems good. You know, it's all food. It's all good stuff. Uh, and we'll just keep selling the stone because we can get stone out the quarry. So it's not a problem. Uh, right, move time on a bit quicker. Here we go. Right, feed the villagers. End of moon 10. So we did significantly better this time than we did last time. So I think this is as far as we got, wasn't it? And we ran out of food. Now we've got a huge pile of food down there, which is wonderful. Okay, so move time on. A bit quick. Berry bushes are being obliterated. Okay, right, you go back over there. And that's a big pile of berries, which is which is really good. Um, and, I mean, do we sell? Uh, there's a berry bush, which is nice. Do we, you work on that? I think we sell two of our berries. Sell two berries. Go to Humble Beginnings. Please give us some wood. Nope, that's all just stone stuff. Okay, hang on then. <laughs> so you go over here and dismantle that. Sell that one piece of stone for a coin. Crikey. Okay, so more stone coming out of that rock. And out of that, that's a piece of stone from the quarry. Sell that. That's flint. We will keep that. Ah, we'll keep the flint because that is useful. Right, so sell those two bits of stone. Humble Beginnings. Give us some wood, please. <laughs> hey, it's a piece of wood, finally. And another rat. Botherations. Okay, you go and fight the rat. And it's another piece of wood, because of course it is. Um, Right, okay. That villager can go and work the berry bush. We need to put a berry... Oh, hang on. Let's feed everybody. There's a bit of a fight going on at the minute. And the key is jumping up and down. Oh, hang on. The key was jumping... Oh, is it because I moused over it? Oh, it might have been because I moused over it. Oh, hang on. A strange portal just appeared. Okay. Do we want the strange portal to be there? It's shaking aggressively. Uh, do we go and attack the strange portal? Do we go and use a key on the strange portal? What do we do with the strange portal? I don't like the strange portal. Um, a bone. A skeleton consists of many of these. <laughs> yes, it does. Well, we've got too many cards. We've got slightly too many cards. Uh, let's use our garden to grow another thing. Uh, right, hang on. Pause time for a second. Pause time. I need a moment to try and work out what we're doing. So we need to put somebody at the lumber camp. Yeah, okay. Let's put you down here. You can work on the lumber camp. Ooh, hang on. Hang on. We've got fighting happening. Let's go and have a fight with a goblin and a rat. Uh, oh, our villager's getting beat up. Our villager is... Oh, no. Our villager has died. <laughs> oh, the goblin's absolutely tough as nails. Maybe at this point we're supposed to have a militia or something. I suspect our villager is going to snuff it. Oh, no. <laughs> Game over. We reach moon 12. Five quests completed. Ten new cards found. But alas, it was not to be. Our villagers have ended up, ended up a bit sort of corpsey and a little bit dead. That goblin was well tough. Goblins are supposed to be rubbish. <laughs> Goblins are like fodder that you just get rid of. And then, yeah, they're kind of just in the way you deal with them. And then go and have the big proper fight with the big kind of scary baddie. I mean, we didn't even kill the rat. Oh, dear. Okay, so maybe by that point, we're supposed to be doing significantly better than I was doing just then. But, I mean, yeah, what was the key for? We got a mysterious key, but I don't know what it was for. 
I mean, I did think we'd try and drag it off the edge of the map, but it didn't do that at all. So, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what the key was for. Food was looking pretty good. We did quite well with food. I mean, maybe in hindsight, we could have gone down the reap and sow type thing. We could have sold a load of berries, gone down reap and sow, and then possibly kind of got a farm going or something a bit better, maybe a bit more efficient. But um, yeah, I think we needed some sort of militia in place at that point. I think maybe we should have done some seeking wisdom to try and get some more ideas. But okay, never mind, never mind. I mean, we gave it a very good go. And we did significantly better that second time round than we did the first time round. But uh, but yes, it was not meant to be, unfortunately. Sorry, little villager type folks. Well, there we go. That was Stacklands. And do you know what? I really, really enjoyed that. I thought that was very, very good indeed. I mean, OK, it didn't exactly end in glory twice. We kind of, you know, end up a bit dead a couple of times. But that's fine. I think that's how you're supposed to play a game like this. I don't think you're supposed to come into a game like this and just be amazing from the off and just, you know, conquer everything on your first go. Because it kind of rewards you going back and playing again. Because, yeah, you keep your ideas, don't you? So you get your ideas and you learn how to do certain things. And then you take them through to your next playthrough and then you can kind of deploy them there and make new different things that you didn't know how to make before. So I think that is very clever. It's very, very clever how it works. And I mean, on the surface, the game is relatively easy to play. It's quite straightforward. You drag a card onto another card. If they can interact, then they will do something. But kind of the sort of underlying kind of depth of the game is how you deploy your cards. I mean, which ones do you sell? Which card packs do you buy? Which kind of things do you get interacting with other things? So there's quite a lot going on kind of, you know, under the surface, if you like. I mean, on the surface, it looks like a pretty sort of jolly, very silly, wacky kind of card game. But there is quite a lot going on underneath. So, yeah, I really enjoyed this. I had a very good fun time with it. But yeah, we did have a good look at it. And I think we have kind of, you know, we've seen an awful lot of the game. We could have possibly seen more. But yeah, I think we've had a very good time with it. So yeah, we'll finish things up for now. Hopefully you did enjoy this. If you did, please do leave a like like that would be most marvellous indeed. And also, if you're not already, then please do subscribe to keep up to date with all the other bits and bobs that we get up to in the Geek Cupboard. But for now, thank you very much for joining me in the Geek Cupboard, and I will see you next time. This sports car is indeed illegal. You clearly couldn't see the sign saying no cars. I have found the place where I'm going to live forever. The Tea and Biscuits Cafe. I want to rename the dog. Uh, let's call it uh, Wuffles. Wuffles McBark. Behold the power of the blimp.